was still barely perceptible. The time was 3 minutes 0.7 seconds, and by now the crowd was roaring. A four-minute mile was possible. Somehow, to do it, I had to run the last lap in 59 seconds. Chataway led round the next bend, and then I pounced past him at the beginning of the back straight, 300 yards from the finish. I had a moment of mixed joy and anguish when my mind took over. It raced well ahead of my body and drew me compellingly forward. I felt that the moment of a lifetime had come. Those last few seconds seemed never ending. A faint line of the finishing tape stood ahead as a haven of peace after the struggle. I leapt at the tape like a man taking his last spring to have, save himself from the chasm that threatens to engulf him. My effort was over, and I collapsed almost unconscious with an arm on either side of me. It was only then that the real pain overtook me. I knew I had done it before I even heard the time. I felt as if I was too close to have failed. <laughs>